breaking news. Memphis police have officially charged this trio in connection with an overnight murder in downtown Memphis. This happened at 275 South Main Street. That's between Pontotoc Avenue and Dr. Martin Luther King Avenue. Action News 5's Jason Miles just spoke with the victim's family in Germantown. He joins us now live from the Breaking News Center with more. Jason? Understandably, Joe, uh, family members were too upset to speak on camera this evening, but they shared photos with me and memories of a man just beginning a new career. One of four children from this large Germantown family, 27-year-old David Santucci had just begun a nursing career with Methodist Hospital when he was shot and killed. Memphis police say it happened around 1.45 early Monday morning in the 200 block of South Main, an area between the more bustling Beale Street and farther south Arts District. His family tells me Santucci had just left a gathering with friends, possibly a birthday party, when he was ambushed. I heard a big bang shot. Jim Davila manages the rumba room just down the street from where Santucci was shot and was outside smoking with a few others when the crime occurred. Being in the bar business, you've had situations, but never, ever anything like this. And this is an absolute tragedy. Thanks to witness descriptions, police found the suspect vehicle in the nearby Foot Homes community, occupied by 23-year-old Mario Patterson, 19-year-old Dondre Johnson, and 23-year-old Jerrica Norfleet, all of whom were charged late Monday evening. Police say Santucci was killed in perpetration of a robbery. Witnesses say he was still alive when paramedics arrived. The response was, was I thought, appropriate. Uh, it's just that, you know, they just couldn't save him, apparently. And Santucci suspected killers are being held without bonds tonight. Initial court appearances are set for tomorrow morning. Reporting live from the Breaking News Center, Jason Miles, Action News 5. Tonight we know at least one person killed in a...